So, a little birdie told me that some of you guys really love playing as a cat and exploring the world, being able to hunt down prey, build up relationships with your other cat friends, and maybe even establish your own territory, your own family, and raise a little litter of kittens. Just something over the past year or so of running our pixel biology community may have given me that hint. And thankfully, we have a brand new game coming in by somebody that a lot of you guys are very familiar with to fill that desire to become a cat, explore the world, have adorable kittens, and basically have an amazing time living out our life as a wild animal. So you guys, welcome to Cattails. And this is the alpha version of Cattails. I am so excited. It is by Tyler Thompson and his wife, Rebecca, and they have been working so hard to bring this to you. And you guys may know Tyler as Falcon Star, and he is the one who made the Untold Tales, Warrior Cats The Untold Tales, which have already provided us with so many hours and so many amazing stories and adventures that we've gone on. And this is his brand new game that he is developing as an independent game creator called Cat Tales. It may or may not have something to do with the obvious uh, background that he has in running around and living as a wild cat in the forest. And I am ridiculously excited because it looks so beautiful and cute and adorable and we're playing the alpha. So uh, with all of that babble aside, it is time to dive in, you guys. This is the pre-alpha version of the game. Cat Tales is now on a Kickstarter. So if you guys want to see this game come to life, you need to go look at the Kickstarter. And those who are interested, please, please, please decide if that's a support that you would really like to do. Because this isn't from, like, a really big company. This is from somebody who could be one of your friends right next to you in the Warrior Cats community who gained the skills and had the time and put in the effort and the tons of hard work to create something awesome to share with all of you. So enough babbling. I will talk about the importance of supporting your independent artists and developers and game creators in the future. I think you guys are really going to want to see what could Cattails possibly offer. Remember, this is the pre-alpha version, so this is not the final version of the game. A lot of those features are still going to be implemented. We are just getting a nice little demo. So I've rambled long enough. Let's go. Okay. Oh my gosh, it's there. He's so cute. Okay, I'm 100% happy. All right, who should we play as? Oh my gosh, this is so adorable. I love, I have such a fondness. I have such a soft spot for being able to, um, for being able to see pixel art. So, oh gosh, and the music is so cute. I keep getting distracted by it. So who should we play as, you guys? Let's see what kind of, oh, look at that. You can change the pelt colors to so many different things. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Um, let's go with a brown pelt, maybe? And what if we go with, like, hmm, maybe a brown pelt and green eyes, because that's what I usually start with. And I kind of wish this was Ren Feather, but, um, hmm, hmm. Who should this be, you guys? Maybe one of the cats that we have had? We do have, you know what? I think that this may be a little cat named Chickadee, because that sounds adorable. So this is our little cat, Chickadee. And we're gonna go ahead and create her, and we're gonna run around and see what Chickadee is going to be able to do in the world. Look at the adorable little paws. I am so in love with all of this. Okay, let's go, let's go. <gasps> okay, 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 we're in the forest colony. Look at this den, oh my gosh. Look at this, and there's, it's morning, summer one, year one. It's sunny, there's a dynamic weather system that I heard he's gonna add in. We are satisfied on food. <gasps> Look, you have a little thing. Oh my gosh, there's a map. Oh my goodness, and you can change your, your. can I really just like jump in here? <gasps> Look, you can just change everything about your coat color. Oh, who's this? Ember, you guys, it's Ember again. Oh my gosh, okay, let's see. Look at that, look at that. Hi there, have you come to check out my fine wares? Have we met before? Allow me to introduce myself. They call me Ember, and I run the store around here. I've got lots of stuff for sale, so stop by if you need anything. Hope to see you around. Oh my gosh, that's adorable. So this is the cat we can come to and we can buy a whole bunch of things from. Look at all the little coins he's got everywhere. This is, oh my goodness, what's this? What's this? 
use den so you can climb on in this is ember's den inside you see a messy assortment of items strewn about the ground listen to how cute the music is look at the plants oh my gosh this is adorable I, okay so if i hold down shift then i can actually start crouching around so oh look and you can see all sorts of things on the map i wonder what that's about i wonder how you can interact i've heard that you can like collect up tons of rare items um there's going to be a political system in place so that you can expand territories for the different groups of cats who live here whose den is this so is this my den nice i picked a nice mossy spot good going chickadee gosh she's so cute hey look there's a cat named missy hello and then let's see press e to talk to missy Oh my, a little bit, a little bit too close. Oh my gosh, she's so, she, look at her, look at that haunty attitude, I love it. Um, who are you and what do you want from me? Look, you don't know me and I don't know you. Let's get one thing straight. So she's got like little stars down here and it looks like the little heart icon, just like in Harvest Moon, will change depending on how much we build up our relationship with her. I'm Missy and I'm the most important cat in the forest. Got it? Now leave me be, you're wasting my time. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we have Sassy Cat over there. Oh, Doe! What a beautiful name! I almost named my cat Doe. Hey there. How are you doing? Or Doc, excuse me. Oh my gosh, I, still, I feel so silly now. How are you doing today? You know, I don't believe we've met before. Oh my gosh, look at that face. Name's Doc, and I look after the sick and wounded cats around these parts. I've got herbs, medicines, and remedies for just about every kind of ailment you can think of. I wonder if you can come down with really interesting illnesses. That's interesting. If you're ever feeling icky inside or out, come and find me. I've got whatever you need to get back into tip-top shape. Pleasure to meet you. I'll be seeing you around, I'm sure. Thank you, Doc. Oh my gosh. This is cool. So can I collect things? Can I collect like these little sticks? Where am I going? Forest Central. Look at the little mushrooms. Aww. And then let's see. Oh, there's a big mushroom. Can I collect that? I wonder how you figure out what you can collect and what you... Oh my gosh, I, sw I was swimming. <gasps> Look at me. Oh my goodness, that's so cute. I wonder how you figure out... Oh, what's this? Like how to hunt and what to collect. <gasps> Look, you guys. It's a bunny. Okay, so if I hold down, am I going to be do able to do my first hunt? Press space to pounce. I got him. I got him! And then I picked him up! I picked up the rabbit! Now what do I do with him? I've got a whole rabbit! This little bunny got bopped on the head. Oh, that's that's too adorable. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. That's so cute. Oh my goodness, I've got like tears in my eyes. That's just so cute. And then, let's see. Oh, I'm still holding the bunny. Oh look, the bird just landed near me. Okay, I want to put the bunny away. And then I want to pick up... I picked up an item. That's interesting. Valerian, Valerian officialis, uh, a pungent flowering herb, energizes and invigorates cats. Interesting. So that's how you can start picking up different items, and then you can do hunting. What's this? Let's see, the menu for the controls, gotcha. Oh, our skills, look at this. So as you, oh, and forging, swimming, fighting, hunting, maybe we should put in some uh, hunting. Used for finding, tracking, and killing prey. At higher levels, a hunter will become better at pouncing upon small creatures. Focus on his or her, her meals faster and unlock a scent compass to point to nearby prey. Nifty! You need more experience to upgrade this skill any further. And then fighting. Used to improve attack damage and attack speed. You need more XP to upgrade this skill any further. Swimming. Used to float atop body of water. At higher levels, a cat will take less damage from sustained exposure to water and paddle faster, allowing them to fight even the swiftest currents. Oh my gosh, you could make yourself like a river cat. Foraging, used, oh, that's definitely me. Used to find herbs, flowers, and berries in the wilderness. Determines the effectiveness of plants when used to heal and invigorate. At higher levels, the cat will be able to spot growing things effortlessly. You need more experience to upgrade the skill any further. Oh my goodness. This is so exciting. Look, and there's more. There's more prey. All right, can I get this guy? Can I get this guy? Oh, I forgot to pounce. Oh, look, there's a cat wandering by. Hello? Hello, hello? Can I talk to you? Patience? Hello? No, they're busy doing their own cat thing. But that's so cool. You'll just have other cats wandering around now? That's the best. Oh, look, there's another bird. Patience, this is my bird. Oh, I need to remember to pounce. I forget to pounce. Okay, and the bird flew off. Phooey. Oh wait, Patience, were you coming over here? Like, I think they move around during the day because the day is, is continuing on. Oh, what's that? <gasps> Guys, it's a mouse. Okay. Yes, oh, I wasn't close enough. So you need to like crouch to get close enough. And oh, here's more Valerian. Oh, well, the flower is not going to run away from me. Oh, there's the mouse again. 
Okay, so we need to wait. Oh, he, he spotted me. Okay, so there is definitely an element of skill in trying to do your hunting. Wait for that bunny. Oh, he spotted me. I guess you get like a little bit of time. Maybe the little circle over their head is actually when the animals realize that you're coming for them. Ah, dang it. Okay, eventually I'll figure out how to hunt. It's It was really easy the first time I tried and now I just can't quite... Now I can't quite grasp it. That's probably because I'm being a little over eager again. That's okay, we're a little chickadee. That's what we do. We like to we like to kind of be a little bit over eager. Can I wander up this way? <gasps> I can! <gasps> mushrooms! Look you guys, there's more little mushrooms. Oh my gosh. Oh, there's a whole frog. He just hopped away. That is so cool. Where am I wandering? Who even knows? Oh, look at this. This is pretty. All right, let's see if I can come over here. Dang it. Look at this. What? Wait, where am I going? This is suspicious. This is pretty suspicious. All of these little mushrooms. I'm at the forest eaves now. I wonder how big the map is going to be. I hope it's going to be like huge. It already feels huge. Can I see like the little map over here? This is interesting. So I think it just keeps expanding and expanding. And now we have marigold used to treat wounds over time. Interesting. I wonder what's over here. There's more marigold. Oh, look, there's a little squirrel. I wonder if I can get it. Okay, I've got to wait. Got to wait. Oh, I got him! I got him, you guys! And I got a little more experience. That's fantastic. So now we have a little squirrel, the body of a squirrel. His last thoughts were, aw, nuts. Oh my gosh, that's adorable. So I do know that eventually you will be able to woo some of the cats that you can meet in the different uh, territories. I don't want to call them clans because they're not quite clans, uh, but you'll be able to woo the cats from different territories. Woo, I walked right into the water there. And oh, there's a little frog or a toad. That's so cute. He was a different color than the other one. And you'll be able to give them gifts and you'll be able to exchange rare gifts with your friends. And oh, I'm getting hungry. That's interesting. I wonder like how I eat the prey I've been catching. Look at this. And then we're at the flower plains now too. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. So how do I get back to my den really quickly? Oh, I can pick this. I just found some golden seal. Wow, a plant with a bright red berry treats wounds over time. Look at how big the territory is that we've already been in. And we've hardly even explored this spot. Oh my gosh, so this is the western field. What's down here? This looks very nice. Very organized. Interesting. I wonder if you can run into dogs and things like that. We're gonna have to see. Oh, whoa! Did you see how pretty that is? Oh my gosh, it just lit up. That was so pretty. The little lantern just lit up as, as the night went on. Oh my goodness, look at the little path. Guys, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, there's a house. I wonder if that's gonna be a good thing or a bad thing for us. Hmm. <gasps> There's fireflies. They're so pretty. Oh my gosh. Fi and there was a chipmunk. Did you see the chipmunk? Oh, and there's a fish. Can I get the fish? Oh, I got the fish. I got the fish. I'm a good fisher. I got a whole bass. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This is so cool. And then you can decide I'm going to eat the bass. And now I'm full. That is so cool. So if I got injured somehow, I could probably try eating the herbs and healing myself. So let's see, I think if I go this direction, this is Forest Central, the Forest Colony. There we go, we're back to our colony. Oh, there's a mayor. I didn't even talk to the mayor yet. I just kind of ran for it because I was so excited. I wonder how we could get things from Ember. Uh, check out the fine wares. Let's talk for a second, Ember. Did you know the average cat needs about three mice worth of food a day to survive? And luckily for you, I've got the best mice in the business for cheap prices. So are you hungry at all? Interesting. We're going to have to figure out how we can start earning a little bit of income, if that's what we do. Let's come up and talk to our mayor. Very interesting. Mr. Mayor? Greetings. Stay sharp out there and don't wander too far from the borders. I don't believe we've been properly introduced yet. My name is Mayor. I'm the leader of the forest colony, so I don't want to see you causing any trouble. But I don't expect you'll be causing any. You seem nice. Welcome to the family. Look at that little smirk. Oh my gosh. All right, so can I like give? How do you, what if I try holding the bunny? And I'm holding the bunny. And um, I think if it said something, drop, put away. I think, I think I dropped it. Did I give it to the mayor? 
I may have just dropped it straight on top of him. I'm sure there's something that's supposed to pop up when you actually give an item to someone. But look at how the night is progressing. And like there's fireflies lighting up the area at random. This is so pretty. <gasps> look at my den! Please tell me I can decorate my den however I so wish. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. No, no. I didn't want to use it. I just wanted to hold the marigold. And then I'm going to drop it. <gasps> oh my goodness. I can customize my little den. You guys. You guys. This is, this is too good. This is just too good. All right. So we're going to go ahead. We're going to drop this flower right over there. I wonder if you can buy like all sorts of unique special items uh, from from oh no ember what if you can buy special items from ember and just like decorate it what if you can find shiny things again oh my gosh because chickadee i could see our little chickadee being such a little cat hoarder who just likes to collect all sorts of things she's a pat cat <gasps> i love it okay we're gonna go ahead and use the bed we're gonna go ahead uh and go to sleep look at all oh my gosh when they curl up like that this is so charming and with these kinds of pixel games, I always just think that there's so much potential for hidden Easter eggs, for like different items that you have to be in certain spots to discover. I have no idea if that's going to be the case here. Who's Scout? Hello, Scout. Huh? Did you need something? I don't think I know you. How about we change that right now? Name Scout. I work for Mayor. Our little domain relies on my skills to make sure the borders are, are safe and all. It isn't a glamorous job, but hey, someone's got to do it. That's so cute. I wonder, I need to figure out. Did you need something? I've got really good at staying hidden from sight from hunting all the time. You've got to know how close you can get to the mice and rabbits before they're going to scurry away if you want to be any good at it. Remember to make as little noise as possible and keep downwind if you can. That's so cool. I wonder how I can possibly start giving things to people. Uh, what about Doc? Let's see, talk to him. You've got a sharp mind, you know that? Uh, nurture that talent, chickadee. That's how you go far in life, you know? Keep your brain in good shape, all right? Oh, Doc, all right. I, I wonder if I can see what's inside of his den. A strong scent of herbs and flowers wafts from the door. Oh, I love that I can collect things and decorate my den with it. That just makes me so ridiculously happy. And let's see what's inside of Ember's shop. Look, we can sell items. Oh my gosh, let's see what we, he has to buy. Excellent, take your time and look around. These are bargain prices on items of exceptional quality. All right, so he's got a mouse, a dove, a rabbit, golden seal, marigold. Oh my gosh, he's got so many pages. Look, he's got raspberries and valerian, and he has different colors of coats that you can actually buy. Look at how cool that is. Wow, oh my gosh, there's even tabby coat. That's so cool. Bee tabby, that's adorable. Brown tiger tabby, frost tabby, oh my gosh. Calico Mania color. You guys, we're gonna have to buy some of these, like the tortoise color, the model brown color. That would totally fit Chickadee. So if I was going to buy some of them from Ember, how would I go ahead and uh, get a little bit of money for that? You're here to sell? Fantastic. Here's what I can offer for your goods. What would you like to sell? What about this fine golden seal, huh? Sell for two. You know what? Two Mews. Oh my gosh, they're called Mews. That's adorable. Look, we have two Mews, you guys! What about this bunny? Or uh, the squirrel? Okay, so you can select multiple items. Man, it would take a while. I guess he wants rare stuff. It would probably take a while to collect uh, enough, enough Mews. I love that that's what they're called. To be able to buy the new coat colors. Oh my goodness, and this is just the alpha version. I am so impressed. As time goes on, there'll be a lot more added in. And you can actually see all the information for things that are planned for the game down in the Kickstarter. And you can see how these are like samples of the music that would be used. Oh, 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 oh. Can I get it? Can I get it? Oh, I got it! Yes! All right, I got a dove. Wonderful. You can see that there would be samples of the music used. There's going to be... How do you get it? Music. Rumbling Stones Bridge. Each area has like its own definition. That is so interesting. I wonder, oh, look at this. Oh my, I wonder if it's safe. I wonder if there's gonna be any cars. Hmm, or any monsters, depending on which group you're talking about. Look at that, she's just strutting along. I wonder how many skills there are going to be in the end. Look, there's some goldenrod. I wonder how many skills there are going to be in the end too. 
because I know in Untold Tales, he included so many cool skills. So I would bet there's going to be quite a bit still to come. And if you guys, even if you can't uh, like contribute to the Kickstarter to be able to help Tyler and his, Tyler the Thompsons develop their game, then it always helps just to share the information for those who possibly can. Because again, this is like an independent creator. This isn't somebody who has a big studio backing them. And I think, I believe from reading the information I did that he actually has completely dedicated himself to trying to make this happen. And this is his full-time thing right now. And that's a bit of a gamble. It's kind of the risk that a lot of game developers take. So I think it's really important to support Support them if you think this is something that you're really going for. A lot of people are like, but I want it to be free. And if you've ever had that kind of idea, try to make something. Try to make something today. Look at look at that. Oh my gosh, the little frog totally just escaped from me. That is so cute. But just try making something. Try making something today, and then think about the scale of creating something this big, and the scale of how much you want to really work hard at making it as absolutely awesome as you possibly can. Can. And it'll give you a little bit of insight where sometimes you really have to just lean in and give some support to your creators to make things happen. <gasps> There's a little fish! Can I get the little fish? I want him. I don't think I can get him. I think that would be a bad idea. I think I would end up far too far into the water. But we're going to see what else we can do. I think there's a little bit more room to explore. There's going to be more colonies added. I hear there's going to be a lot of cats added. If you check on Falconstar slash um, Cattails Twitter, there's two different Twitters you can follow. I follow both. But the Cattails Twitter will often show little updates of what's going on in developing the game and being able to get feedback and being able to like test with a whole bunch of cats. He's been posting so many screenshots to just make me ha like get so, so, so excited. All right, let's wait for this. And I got him. Yes. All right. We got another squirrel. So we're going to work on tending to our forest colony. We're going to work on exploring so we have a good concept of where the map goes. Look at this. And there's so many cats just randomly showing up. I think you're supposed to like show up during the day. Look. Lyris! Who the heck is Lyris? Good day to you, my rose. Ah, oh, like a fresh breeze in the thick of spring, so a new face brings life to my soul. We have not met before, have we? My name is Lyris. I do hope you will stop by again. It has been a pleasure to meet one as exquisite as you. Oh my gosh. And we're going to have to figure out if we can like befriend these cats. I know eventually you'll be able to befriend them and you'll be able to have kittens with them and raise a family with them, which sounds absolutely amazing. And I'm really intrigued at learning about that political system that we heard a little bit about. So let me go ahead. I'm going to eat my, I thought I had a fish, but you know what? The squirrel is going to have to do. There we go. All right, guys. I hope you guys are just as excited. Look, the cats are moving around. They go in different places at different times of the day. How awesome is that? But I hope you guys are just as excited as I am about being able to dive on in, being able to explore what the Cattails demo has for us. We will be doing some daily exploring in it for a little while to see uh, just all that the demo has to offer. Remember, this is just early in the game. So let's see. Let's go ahead and drop this in here. I wonder if we'd ever be able to like get special glowing items, like maybe somehow capture a firefly or like a glowing mushroom so that you could really, really decorate your den. I know that sounds ridiculous, but that is something I would probably end up spending like forever doing, just collecting all these random items that have no other purpose other than to make my den look pretty. I would totally do it. Look, we're already starting to organize it. So we'll continue to decorate our den. We'll continue to wander around and try to earn some muse to unlock the different coats. And we will do a little bit more exploring next time. But remember, the Kickstarter is up and going. So the month of April is going to be the time where if you have the ability supporting the development of the game so it can become a finished product, this is just the demo, remember that, uh, is very important. That's how things come to life. So I hope you guys look into that. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Let me know and be sure to provide lots of constructive feedback. Uh, it really helps when it's at this stage to figure out where you're going to go with something that is going to hopefully be this utterly charming and adorable and awesome and pretty, um, pretty big. I mean, we've just barely started poking at the edges of a map, so I'm pretty excited to see where everything's going to go. And I will see you guys next time. Oh, she's sitting down. That's so cute. Oh my gosh. All right. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.